Hey, what's up everybody? Who's ready for some more solution stoichiometry? Let's take a quick look at this next problem. We're told that a student adds excess sodium chloride solution to 75.0 milliliters of a solution of silver nitrate to form insoluble solid silver chloride. When it has been dried and weighed, the mass of silver chloride is found to be 2.45 grams. What is the molarity of the original silver nitrate solution? Okay, again, with any stoichiometry problem, you first want to write your balanced chemical equation. Our reactants here are sodium chloride, boom, and silver nitrate. Again, we're talking about solutions here, so I'm going to put aqueous after each of them. They react to form insoluble silver chloride. That's my solid. It's a double replacement reaction. The other compound that's going to form is going to be sodium nitrate, which will be aqueous. And if you're unsure which ones are soluble or insoluble, remember, you can always come back and check your reference chart. Okay, a quick check by inspection lets me know that everything is balanced. Ratio, molar ratios are one to one to one to one. All right, in this problem, we are told that we form 2.45 grams of our solid precipitate AGCL. Remember that we're trying to find the molarity of the original AgNO3 solution. Keep in mind that molarity is equal to moles per liter. We know that we used 75.0 milliliters or 0.075 liters of that solution. So to determine the molarity, I need to know how many moles of silver nitrate did I have? Well, again, if 2.45 grams of silver chloride formed, let's think about how many moles of silver nitrate that must have come from. First thing I'm gonna do is convert my grams of silver chloride to moles of silver chloride. And it was nice enough for the folks who wrote this problem to give us the molar mass of silver chloride. I'm then gonna convert moles of silver chloride to moles of silver nitrate. The ratio there is one to one as given by the balanced chemical equation. So a quick jump to my calculator. Two point four five times one enter divided by one twenty three point three two enter times one enter divided by one enter means that in my original solution I must have had zero point zero one seven one moles of silver nitrate. And if I had 0.0171 moles of silver nitrate in that original 75 milliliters, I can determine the concentration simply by dividing by my volume of zero, forgot a sig fig, oh my goodness, simply by dividing by 0 0.0750. Enter, which means that the original concentration of my solution was 0 0.228 molar. Boom, final answer.